So you publish your first book, but now what? The big sales you were hoping for aren't Flanagan. But why? I get this question all the time. If your book cover is top notch, your interior is well designed, and the market isn't too saturated, then one big issue might be your listing isn't selling the book well enough. Buyers need to see more than just a front cover. They need to see interior shots, compelling visuals, and clear reasons to buy your book over someone else's. See the difference with these listings? They use a content to stand out and get more sales. And you should too. And here's why. Amazon prioritizes listings that use a content and books with it see a 10% more increase in conversion rates. That means more buyers clicking add to cart without running any ads. The best part, this isn't a huge task and you can set it up in under 20 minutes completely free. Today, I'm going to show you exactly how to create and upload a content on Amazon KDP using Canva to boost your book sales. And stick around because at the end, I'll show you three of the best ways to find the top keywords that best-selling books are using. So you don't just improve your listing visually, you also want to make sure it ranks in Amazon search. Also, if you need help starting a KDP, you can check out my video here. If you haven't created your KDP book yet, I would start here and then come back after it's published. A plus content is that extra section on your Amazon listing where you can add more images, descriptions, and branding to make your book stand out. And Amazon actually prioritizes listings that have A plus content, making it easier for buyers to click add to cart. So if your book isn't using it, you're missing out on potential sales. Before we start designing, let's check out how the best selling books in your niche use A plus content so you can reverse engineer what works. So you'll go to Amazon and search your niche, type in your book's main keywords, if it's mindful journal for moms or funny coloring book for adults. Then look for the best sellers in the A plus content, click on books with high sales ranks, think under 50K BSR, and scroll down to see if they have A plus content. If they do, analyze what they include. Are they showing inside pages? Do they highlight unique features? Do they use lifestyle mockups? Take notes on patterns and styles and you'll start seeing a pattern of what works. If the best sellers use bold headlines, clean icons, and full page previews, you'll want to incorporate something similar, but in your own style. All right, let's create your high converting A plus content in Canva. First, you'll go to Canva, create a design, set the dimensions to 970 by 600 pixels, which is Amazon's recommended size. Add high quality image of your book's interiors, include short eye-catching headline, Highlight three benefits your book offers, helps you stay organized, includes guided prompts, perfect for stress relief, and make it visual. Use Canva mock-up tool to show your book in action and create a comparison graphic, a plain journal versus your features. Add icons to show your book is for kids, students, business owners. We get the point. We all have been on Amazon and we know that Amazon shoppers skim before they buy. Make your A plus content visual and easy to read. The more scannable it is, the more likely someone purchases it. After the Canva design section, here's what to avoid. Don't use blurry or low quality images. Amazon will reject them. Don't use too much text. Keep it visual. If buyers have to read too much, they'll definitely leave. Now also remember to make it mobile phone friendly. Over 60% of Amazon shoppers browse on their phones. Small text, no sales. Once your Canva designs are ready, and here's how to upload them. Go back into KDP, go into marketing, go to A plus content manager. Click on create A plus content. Use the module and I recommend standard image with text. Upload your Canva images and add supporting text and then you'll submit it for approval. Amazon usually waits about 24 to 48 hours for approval. Okay, now your book looks amazing, but your keywords aren't strong. Buyers still won't find it. Even a small tweak to your keywords can lead to a huge boost in sales. If your book isn't ranking in search, even the best A plus content won't get it seen. Let me show you how to find the exact keywords that best sellers in your niche are using so you can optimize your title, subtitle, and backend keywords for better discoverability. We're going to use three tools to find high traffic keywords that are already making other books money. Number one is Helium 10. It's paid, but it's best for serious sellers. You can see the exact keywords best sellers are ranking for, and you can find low competition, high demand phrases. Number two is Productor by Merch by Amazon, and it's free. It gives you keyword trends for low content books, journals, planners, coloring books. It shows you estimated sales and competition for each keyword. And number three is E-Rank. It's best for Etsy, but it can also be used for Amazon KDP. It helps you find related keywords and trending search terms on Amazon and Etsy. 
Pro tip, compare all three tools to find the best keywords to add to your listing. Even the small tweaks to your subtitler title can boost visibility and sales. Adding a content boosts buyer confidence and can increase conversions without spending extra on ads. Test different layouts to see what works best for your book. If you're serious about selling more books, this is one of the easiest ways to make your listing stand out. Comment below if you've tried a content or drop your book niche and I'll give you a keyword strategy to boost your sales. And if you want more tips on selling books on KDP, watch this video next. Subscribe for more KDP, passive income, and digital product strategies. See you in the next video.